All right, here we got the 2024 Kia Sorento. This is an X-Line SX Prestige all-wheel drive. It's a 2.5 liter turbocharged engine, 281 horsepower, 311 horsepower, or foot pounds of torque. This one comes in a sticker at about $49,000 after all the options. And it's got this unique color. It's Road Rider Brown is what it says. And normally I would not be interested in a brown, but it actually doesn't offend me too bad. New styling on the remodel, as you can see. 2024, they did a, a refresh of the exterior of this vehicle. With the X-Line, you get all the black accent, the chrome delete, so to speak. Um, let's get on the inside. This has been a good, a good vehicle for Kia over the years. Got your typical Kia dual infotainment screen, so your gauge cluster, infotainment here, cup holders. Yeah, it's a pretty comfy, comfy seat. It's got the fake trim, wood trim, but it looks nice. This is all still hard plastics up here that just has a, a bit of a styling to it. You've got a panoramic sunroof on it. Looks good. And then in the seat, you can see it's got X-Line in the seat. Center console, little phone, you got a wireless charger up here, and then a whole bunch of power outlets. You've got, so you can just do power only, or you're doing power and hooking your phone for like Apple CarPlay here. That's how you switch between the two. If you're like, I want to plug my phone in, but I don't want Apple CarPlay to activate or Android Auto, then you'd hit this to just be battery charge. This one has heated and cooled front seats for both the driver and passenger, which is pretty cool. Let's check out the rear. This one comes with the captain's chairs. So the back seat's gonna have captain's chairs. Climb in here. Let's see. It's a pretty comfy seat, very padded, good leg room, and then looking at the headroom, got good headroom even though it's got this full panoramic sunroof on it. Backseat passengers have a couple uh, vents for them to hear, power cords pass through here, and then I'm not sure why this seat keeps moving on me without me doing anything, but it does. And then you do have three rows, but your third row pretty much eats into your uh, storage space. Let's see if we can get this back door open. Here it is. So power lift gate. So as you can see, if you're going to have the third row up, you're going you're gonna to lose a lot of your storage space in the rear. But you do get a little bit of under storage underneath the the rear floor which is nice kind of helps make up for that and then you can see the 50 50 split on the rear fold down seats come up here good power tailgate the rear mostly what they changed here are the rear tail lights have different styling got the new kia logo i actually like this refresh i think it did a good job changing some of the things that needed to be updated on the Sorento but 2024 Kia Sorento there you have it